Grant here again. Gonna be installing a TKI belt kit um, to gear down on my RMK. Gonna be using it for out in the mountains in the winter and then actually for the water. Flipping around here. So I've got a couple different gear sets to try on the water as well as in the mountain. Um, this is a 2020 850 RMK. I've got the stock gears in it still. Um, Pretty crazy gear ratios we can go down to. And this is a 24 to 25, 26, 27. So I can kind of play with which one I like the most. I'm gonna do a lot of testing on the water as well in the snow. Um, I'm gonna start with just going really aggressive and go to the 24. I think it's a 2.61. It changes the two from a 2.05, I believe is the stock gearing. So that's pretty aggressive change. Um, it's gonna spin the track a little bit faster. Um, so we'll see. Stay tuned as we install this. It's pretty easy to put in. Um, basically, the biggest thing that I've collected, you know, from reading online and stuff, how I do it is uh, these bolts, these like T40s or whatever. You need to heat these up like you're working on a helix and a clutch. Um, there's a uh, glue inside of them, kind of a Loctite from Polaris, so you got to get out. And then these guys, you want to make sure you set your brake too before you start this because you don't want anything to roll around. Slip those off. I've had them off in the past and then it's been kind of a headache, but hopefully this goes smoothly. Got the old stock gears off and belt. I'm gonna be putting the new one on. Once again, I am gonna start with the 24, which should convert it to a 2.61, which would be the most aggressive, and we can always go down from there. So stay tuned as I install that on here now. everything all installed. A little trick here, you can stick a wrench in there to uh, get the side panel over. Got the exhaust just set back in here. Um, Got to go ride a little bit and then keep checking this tension. It's supposed to have like an eighth of play. It's a little tight, but we'll see here. Um, then you just adjust her off this adjuster. Pretty simple install. Um, we'll see how this goes. Freaking CNAs on the old phaser, eh? What do you gotta say to that? Oh, why not? <laughs> <laughs> Here's RMK apart doing her Cobra cord since I already did mine, of course. But yeah, I just wanted to show you a little trick that I found um, that's super, super helpful in this. So you can see how there's, just for an example, how the holes line up for the recoil, unlike a lot of the skeeters and stuff. So if you wanted to keep tension, you just put a screwdriver in and that's gonna hold tension so you can change your rope as long as it hasn't exploded. Makes it super easy to put the Cobra cords in and then hopefully never, never breaks. So yeah, a little tech trip, tech trick. <laughs> little update on this, got Erica's uh, tether all hooked in here. Pretty easy install. It's actually pretty nice. It's magnetic and it clips on too. Excited to use that. Still gotta do a bunch of stuff to mine. Just gotta put her clutch kit in and then this thing will be ready to rock for out west.